Hey everybody. All right, so today's Tuesday, September 13th, and I thought I would talk to you a little bit about something that just happened to me about an hour ago. And this is probably the first time that I've ever made such a fresh video, except for my first video, where I came home from the doctor and immediately hit like record. So anyway, this actually happened to me today, and this video is going up today, so this is, this is new. This is new for me. Also, I feel like my facial hair is worth noting for once. This is what almost eight years on testosterone has given me. I grew it myself, thanks. And now that you've seen my very legitimate beard, you know you wanna click right there and donate to my Kickstarter, right, for my EP? Maybe my beard will grow longer if you do. All right, all right, all right, all right. So, so, so. Today I went to refill my testosterone prescription. I love my, <laughs> oh, I need to go cross that out. I'm just, I'm just scratching off the address on my T vial right now so that you can't see it. Cool, we're good. This is my testosterone and this is my prescription for it. This is what it comes in. It comes in this tiny box. This is it. All this testosterone. So this is a 10 milliliter vial. It's not very big. It contains 2000 milligrams. This vial itself will last me like 40 weeks. I take a little bit over 50 per week, so it lasts me about 35. There you go. I mean, 35 weeks of the year. This lasts me almost an entire year. Just this one tiny little bottle. So when I dropped off my prescription, I let her know, you know, it's a new pharmacy for me, and I need the 10 milliliter vial. That's what my doctor recommends. That's what she prescribed to me, and I just wanted to make sure it went through. So the woman was like, okay, well, we could definitely give you the 10 milliliter vial. We do have it in stock. It just depends if your insurance will cover it or not. And so I was like, okay, no problem, whatever. I drop off my prescription for that, and I drop off my prescription for the syringes that I need to inject my shots. So last week, I pretty much ran out of the vial, as you can see, and I needed to pick it up. So I went today. The lady I saw her put it down in front of me, and it said it was $118. $118. At the last CVS that I got my tea from, I think I paid a $10 copay to get that exact vial of testosterone. And so I looked down and I'm like, hmm, that seems like a lot. And the woman's being really nice to me and so I just said to her, I was like, oh, you know, that's a lot more than it usually is. Did you try running it through my insurance? And she was like, oh no, it looks like they didn't even run it through your insurance. You have your card on you. So I handed her my insurance card and she took that and the vial and she went back to the pharmacist and I guess they, they typed it something and they were looking at something and boom it went down to ten dollars my insurance was able to cover it they were able to cover the 10 milliliter vial for me and now I only had to pay ten dollars so I left CVS paying approximately fourteen dollars and fifty three cents for my testosterone a new loofah and my syringes I know I just need a loofah okay I just I needed a new loofah it was time so I left, you know, barely paying 15 bucks for all of these things. Whereas if I had looked at it, just seen the $118, I know my previous self. I know how I used to feel and I know that I was non-confrontational. I would have just paid the $118 and I don't have that much money. When I saw that and when I thought about it, I just wanted to make this video and let you all know that if your insurance covers it, testosterone is not that expensive. But in all honesty, I was uninsured for a bit of time and I had to pay the $100 for testosterone. But like I said, it lasts me like eight to 10 months. So to spend $100 on something that is important to me and important for my physical health and my mental health, which is testosterone, to spend $100 on something that will last me eight to 10 months is worthwhile. And it doesn't seem like that much considering everything that testosterone does. I mean, the beard. Of course. <laughs> but basically, I highly recommend to folks out there who are worried and concerned about the financial costs of your transition to get to know your insurance policy, to get to know your pharmacy, and get to know where it's going to be covered. Because, for example, the medication that I stopped taking, finasteride, which was to prevent balding, my insurance doesn't cover it at either of these places. CVS charges me like 150 Walmart charges me $8.99, so I send my prescription up to Walmart in Maine and I get it filled there. So I just recommend shopping around, looking into things. To give you another idea of why you should always ask questions and also shop around to the pharmacy that you're gonna obtain it from is that some pharmacies run out of testosterone and they run out more frequently than other pharmacies. There's a couple that are regularly out of it. I've heard Rite Aid has been out of it. Walgreens has been out of it. Um, I've always got mine from CVS, but there have been times where they've actually had a shortage on the big vial that I need. 
don't do what I almost just did. I almost didn't speak up for myself and I'm so happy I did. And then the lady in front of me was like, wow, it's really good that you mentioned that. It's really good that you looked at it because you would have walked out of here paying $118 for this and now we got it down to 10. And we both had this moment of, yeah, good thing that I asked and yeah, good thing that we double checked. It was just this very positive experience. And as someone who often avoids confrontation or doesn't like to correct people in public places, I just wanted to empower you all to shop around for your prescriptions and find what works for you and get the price that you deserve and make sure just double check if the insurance covers it because ain't nobody should be paying $100 more than usual. In the end, I got like eight months worth of testosterone uh, for $10. Yes. <laughs> Anywho, just wanted to share that little story with you all. Hair is growing back fast. <laughs> growing back fast. I love this hat that I got. I'm gonna work out later. All right. Peace, love, subscribe, share. I will be back as soon as possible. Love you all so very, very much, and we'll talk soon. Bye.